been a while since we've seen Toronto FC in MLS action. How you doing, Dunny? Nice to see you, Wheels. Terry Dunfield, Gareth Wheeler with you. But ahead of Toronto FC's match this weekend against the Los Angeles Galaxy, we did see them have success in the Canadian Championship over two legs against the Montreal Impact. It has to be such a morale boost to this squad, Terry. A team that played without Bradley, without Altidore, and a fully fit Seba over two legs. Yeah, we've not seen, seen them in the league since the 28th of May against the New York Red Bulls, but they've been fantastic over two legs against the Montreal Impact. For me, I loved how we saw two sides to this Toronto FC team. In the first leg, they were open, they were expansive. They played some real good attacking football. Then in the second leg, they protected a two-goal lead. They came out with a gritty nil-nil. They were professional, they were disciplined, they were compact. The one consistency over the two legs was the formation, a 4-2-3-1, Terry. As a former player, how important is it to have consistency in approach game to game? Yeah, we saw the same players play two games, and I thought Greg Vanny picked the perfect system for the players. The players really suited that system. I love Ben Washe, Rue coming in, holding things together for the young players in and around him. He had a great range of passing defensively. He worked really hard for the team, and he got the young players doing some of the leg work for him. Up top, I thought Jordan Hamilton was terrific. Mm -hmm. He was the perfect number nine. He held the ball up. He ran in behind. Defensively, he set the press off, and he also scored two goals in the first leg. And with that approach, I mean, I think we know what to expect from a well-rested TFC side out of the weekend. Now, the Los Angeles Galaxy will be playing without Keane, who's at the European Championship. Zardes at the Copa America. That has to mean good things for TFC. It's got to, but they still have other star players. Steven Gerrard could be coming into town. Giovanni De Santos, he turned on a call up to Mexico, so he'll be coming into town as well. But big positive news for TFC. Juvinko, he came on for the last 15 minutes at Stad Sabuto, so he should be fresh and raring to go. The Los Angeles Galaxy also coming off a midweek U.S. Open Cup game. So more skewing in TFC's favor. It's going to be a big night at BMO Field Saturday night underneath the lights taking on the mighty Galaxy 